you know where to find you know them? Where? I think it's... <laughs> <laughs> no, this one Dead doesn't shit. Welcome back to London Vegans. Oh God, have we started? <laughs> we started. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, he decided to start it by telling me this time. I know, yeah. <laughs> Not like last time. That was a cut. Uh, how are you? Not too shabby. How are you after I'm all right. your skiing? Uh, yeah. How, how amazing was that? It's the first time I've skied. If you haven't actually checked out the video, um, check back to oh, London Vegan Stateside in Colorado, Denver and Aspen. Did you get really stoned in Colorado? No, but... I, oh, because it's legal out there. I know, because we were doing a radio trick, because it's Sorry, quite professional. Sorry, I shouldn't say things like this. <laughs> we aren't really meant to be doing that, but... Yeah, I know, it's um, obviously mm. readily available yeah, and but, legal. But that's home of South Park, isn't it, Colorado? Yeah, I don't know anything about South Park. But you went through Denver Airport and didn't take any photos of the massive you weird that, mural. I know, you sent them a message saying, check out the mural. And I, I oh, was so swept away by what was going on. There was so much to do, because we were literally up at six o'clock mm. in the morning doing interviews, like one after the other, and meeting lots of people and selling the radio station and being the salesman. So we didn't really get the chance to see everything. Ah, oh, the mural at the airport. Because I mean, I, I'm not, I don't believe in conspiracy theories, but I find them quite interesting. And all the stuff about Denver Airport's quite interesting. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah. Next time. Next see, that's why I kept saying, I kept saying, I've got to come back and see more mm, of it. And people but, say, did you see such and such? And but I you had some yummy food out there, had didn't you? Had some really yummy food. The most amazing um, places, cafes and restaurants that are really doing the whole vegan thing. I think mm. a lot of it is for health reasons. Yeah, the plant-based more than... Because the more people that were talking to me about it, they were saying, you know, it, it, you know, obviously it's a really healthy thing and they mm. weren't really necessarily talking about the animals, but... Talk about the animals. Hopefully it'll come to them one day. Mm. I think we're going to be travelling a lot this year. Yeah, I think so. Mm. Um, hopefully off out to Rome in uh, Easter as well with Mishkin, I'm with another to... vegan. No, I have been to Rome once on a oh, cruise Rome's just for the day, yeah. I wasn't a vegan when I went out there. So, um, so being with someone, well, Mishkin was a person who basically encouraged me to go vegan. Um, go so, Mishkin. Yeah, shout out to Mish. Anyway, today we are um, sampling some free food that yes. Creative Nature have very kindly sent us. Now, they sent these a few weeks ago. In fact, they sent all of this a few weeks ago. We've only just got round to, to reviewing these. Because so we have been stuffing our faces. We need to shake these like maracas. No, this <laughs> one doesn't shake. This one's powder, <laughs> yeah, that you one knobber. doesn't make any noise. So we've got the cacao nibs. Um, and the raw cacao. Do you use these cacao. in food? These are great in porridge. Had these You're in talking porridge to the morning. person who doesn't make food. You, yeah, but you must use stuff like this because it's so convenient. I mean, what, what do you have for breakfast? Breakfast is generally a banana. You are carry. <laughs> <laughs> these are great, and these are so good for you as well because I think they're high in. Um, is it? Magnesium, or maybe it's the Magnesium's cacao powder. Magnesium's great, I use magnesium. It fights fatigue. Uh, uh, uh. Gluten, wheat and dairy free, that's what we like to see. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah I'd be careful with that one, because it would go, yeah. yeah, I know what you like. I think it's, <laughs> I think what we need to do is, I think you need to teach me how to cook. That's a good idea. Not that I'm an expert. Or we need, or is anybody out there who's willing to do some cookery videos with us that's and teach us idea. how to cook? Yeah, we need a guest Encourage chef. Encourage me yeah. to cook. I want to try the cacao orange. I have to say, there's not one that I'm not looking forward to, mm. so cacao orange. Smells good. They're quite thick, aren't they, compared to some bars. Mm. It's quite a nice um, citrusy hit when you first taste it. Mm. But I, I like it more orangey. It but tastes it's... like real orange, though. It doesn't mm. taste like synthetic no. flavour. It's really nice. Mm. I would eat that. Now, these are made, as a lot of bars are, uh, mainly with dates. Yeah. So dates is the top ingredient. We've got um, soya protein, chicory, chicory fiber, rice protein, pea protein, cocoa fiber, and per bar, 151 calories, which is about the norm, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, which eight, is good. Eight grams of protein. Oh, it says 21% protein. Mm. And certified by the Vegan Society. Mm. So apple pie protein. Yeah. yeah, I'm not sure about this one. I like apple. I don't flavor. like. I've got a thing about apple flavour, banana flavour, and obviously, no, I'm not going to take such a big bit this time. I love apple pie. I mm. love apple, but apple flavoured things I find really hard to eat. Yeah, it's nice. It no. probably wouldn't be my favourite no. of the lot, but it does taste like a 
like a real apple flavour. It doesn't taste synthetic. No, it doesn't, but it's not a flavour I go for. I prefer to have an apple. Salted caramel. Is this the one you're really looking for? See, sometimes you're in the mood for fruity this one ones. Looks, this one looks a <laughs> different um, texture to the others. It smells, it smells quite nice. Yeah, it looks like a different texture. It looks softer. Okay. Salted caramel is a really popular flavour, isn't it, now? It is really big, isn't it, at the moment? Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. I really like that one. That's, that's your favourite. really nice. We'll stick that yeah, out. Yeah, that's definitely the favourite so far. Mm. Go to your goodness. I wouldn't tend to go for a berry bar. No, I would. I'm not keen on raspberries. I love blueberries. I love strawberries. Um, but I wouldn't tend to go for a berry bar for some reason. I don't really know why. It's not I really my favourite. Well, oh, that is really nice. That salted caramel. Mmm. My taste. Toffee toffee, toffee, toffee. Yeah, toffee, toffee. Toffee, toffee. 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 Oh. Sorry, everyone. I, I forgot to get my water. Do you want me to get it for you? No, it's okay. Do you know where to find it? Hello there. I don't usually buy bottles of water. I just like to print this out. I do have a I refillable see. one. It's just that I forgot to bring it home. So I am feeling really crap buying a plastic bottle of water. At it's the one moment. of my New Year's resolutions I'm really to sorry. hydrate more. I got a free bottle. Oh. Um, a free, you know the ones that you put fruit in? and it looks like it's in a massive dildo. So you stuff it full of fruit. So you, I usually have lemon and water, but I got a free one because Wilco's opened in Lewisham the oh, other day wow. and we all got them free. You put the fruit in the bottom, it's like a, what do they call it? You know diffuser. the one that you had that I... you put bloody cucumber in because you're a poncy gear. <laughs> oh, no. Cucumber that's full of nothing. <laughs> no, cucumber is full of nutrition. It's full of vitamins. It is, seriously. No, cucumber's got something cucumber. in it. Seriously, it's a miracle food. And did you know it was? <laughs> <laughs> Try that and shut up. <laughs> so goji goodness. Goji goodness. This is chewy. I like that one. Ooh. Mmm. That's a real surprise because I thought I was going to be my most favourite, but actually What's that's this my favourite. What's me of? Mmm. I really like this That's one. a really nice flavour, isn't mm. it? It's really sweet, but not too sweet. Mm. And it's the chewy. It's a chewy that fruit. That salted caramel, definitely my favourite. That one is my favourite as well. Mmm. Oh, that's a surprise. That's the yeah. that is. There you go. Very... Yeah. Uh oh. Ooh, it's a weird colour in it. Ginger tea tops. Mm. And this so is I presume it's ginger tea. 121 calories, no sweetness, and I'm one of your five a day. day. Slip into your skinny jeans and enjoy, I wish. Well, I, I am. It does tell me to do that, so I'm going to believe them. I'm going to yeah. believe I can do it. Yeah, just eat that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I like that. I love ginger, though. I'm a big fan of, like my mum, I'm a big fan of ginger. Crystallised ginger. It's good, isn't it? Mmm. That would be perfect. That's nice. If you need something zingy. Mmm. It's quite refreshing, isn't it? I mean... The winner? You like the mm, caramel one, salted caramel. I'm quite, it's... I think it's... <laughs> <laughs> she always does it. Oops. Um, it's kind of a toss-up. It's good to wear not yours, isn't it? That, that'd have cat hair all over it now. <laughs> Oi, leave my rescue cats alone. I really like these two, but I did like that one. That's yeah. not... A horrible, it's not no. that, I think it's probably stem ginger I don't like. Right. I like that, that is, that's not like a fiery ginger, is no, it? And no, that's no, really you nice. You like apple than ginger, but you don't like apple though. Big <laughs> thumbs up from us. And by the way, if yeah. you want to buy some of these, check the links below because we've put um, mm. links to them uh, on Amazon in the description yeah. box. And, and we're putting one in a little give, in our little giveaway pack. Yes. Today. As always, thank you for watching. Hello. Oh no, bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. She doesn't know whether she's coming or going. <laughs>